Alright guys, I'm making a video about this uh, new Envo mask. This is an N95 mask uh, featuring air drill technology. Um, so I recently bought it. I haven't opened this box yet. I never used this kind of mask before. Uh, so far I've been using the N95 mask uh, provided by the hospital. And um, uh, I, I just couldn't take the N95 masks anymore. A very uncomfortable uh, breakouts everywhere on the face. Just uh, hard to breathe through those masks. And uh, you know, and then it's just hard to come by. You know, you can't get those N95 masks frequently. And it's just horrible, uncomfortable uh, using those N95 masks. So uh, I saw a couple of my buddies uh, using this uh, Envo mask. So I, I thought I'll check it out and um, make a video about this saying uh, how uh, the overall experience of this mask is. Uh, today is going to be an unboxing and a quick review and um, I'm going to try it and then I'm going to and I'm going to try it for a few uh, weeks and I'm going to make another video um, showing the progress and the experience with this mask. So this is Envo mask. The boss states, uh, states it's an Envo mask featuring air gel technology. I bought it from envomask.com of course uh, it says a uh, reusable mask disposable n95 filters comfortable air gel seal uh, so pretty much the mask filter and uh, housing unit and uh, what other information does it say uh, pretty much it says protection n95 nothing major it says uh, it, it, it filters 95% uh, filter efficiency level against particulates, aerosol, uh, free of oil, uh, yeah, time restriction may apply. Okay, I'm just, I'm just reading through. Uh, not to use an atmosphere containing less than 19.5% of oxygen. Mm. Uh, not sure atmosphere can be dangerous to your life. Do not exceed maximum use. Concentration regulatory standard. Da da da. Pretty much is saying that um, frequent uh, use it properly. Uh, change the filter uh, as required. Uh, <clears throat> it says a uh, prohibited use. Do not use for protection from gases, vapors, um, oil, aerosol, asbestos. Uh, that it doesn't concern us. We are here pretty much using it for uh, uh, you know our COVID issues um, okay let's unbox it and uh, see how it goes and we'll mask it says wrong correct way to do this okay uh, comes with a plastic box very sturdy plastic box I got out I guess I'll store my mask in this Some paperwork. Okay, here's the mask. I did wash my hands before handling uh, clean masks. So, this is the mask. Very soft, comfortable looking gel padding around the mask. Plastic construction on the side. Very nice design. I guess this is an exhalation port. Um, I guess filter goes in between these two. All live, and this is the strap, I guess, for this mask. I didn't order the hook strap. I just ordered the regular strap that goes across your head. I'm gonna figure it out how to um, assemble it later. I'm sure it's gonna be pretty straightforward. Okay, so the mask came with, let's see, five filters. Uh, disposable, replaceable filters. Okay, let me open this so yeah pretty much main reason for buying is the comfort and uh, protection let's see if I can put it to use one thing guys make sure um, our hospital had a new policy stating that oh shit what did I do how do you open this thing that's why you should read instruction Cut. Alright guys, uh, pretty simple setup. Uh, take that filter, 
put it in this cover okay and uh, yeah I'm doing this first time okay just so give me a break no practice ever I'm gonna make this work somehow I hear a clicky sound and uh, yep I think we're golden Yeah, that's that's your um, evil mask. Envil mask, not evil mask. Envil mask. Make sure, guys. Um, our hospital uh, has asked us to put a face mask, a regular surgical mask, over it because this exhalation port doesn't give any protection. When you exhale, you're pretty much, uh, you know, aerosolizing all the bacteria or viruses. So you have you have to use. If you're using this mask, our facility has asked us to first of all get fit tested with this mask and uh, and use a surgical mask. Nobody has time to get fit tested with this. But anyway, so uh, just take care, get, get uh, use it safely, get fit tested first and um, make sure it fits you right and uh, use it as per your hospital protocol. And uh, yeah, def I'll use a surgical mask. It has dual purposes because dual benefits because it'll prevent this um, filter from getting soiled. All right, uh, I did also order um, like the cover that replaces the surgical mask that you can like it, like pretty much it covers the filter rather than wearing this ugly um, I mean that weird looking uh, surgical mask you can use this I like this much better. Again, it's better if you read the instructions. Yeah, so look, it leaves a little bit of space in between the mask and uh, does protect the does protect the filter. It creates a barrier between the filter between the filter and the atmosphere, right? I like this. I like this. And if you order this mask, make sure you order this. Um, what is it? What this? What is it called? It's called a shield. Envo mask shield, yeah, I guess it's a must. It'll, it'll, it will um, extend your life of your mask and prevent any splashes or getting contaminated with your fingers or atmosphere. So I will definitely order this. And also I ordered some uh, 10 extra filters from envomask.com. Yeah, I guess it's required. I'll see how my experience is with this Envo mask setup. I want to try to set up this. I don't know. Maybe I should have ordered the hook one, but um, I guess let me set it up and uh, we'll see how it goes.